How's it going guys? Hope everybody's having a great day. I have a awesome video planned out for you today and tons of interesting videos for the next few weeks to come. It's been extremely busy and if you're wondering what's been happening to the Evo, you're gonna find out soon. <laughs> Anyways, I have something really cool to show you. It's the new daily. I posted a poll on my channel and I was actually pretty surprised to find out that over 25% of you First of all, let me just say I was shocked that almost 200 people answered. Probably by the time of this video, more than 200 people would have answered. But that's pretty insane that 200 people uh, are answering to little old me, little old my question. Anyways, without further ado, let me show you what it is. This is the rocket ship itself, and this is the new daily. Uh, in case you don't know immediately off the bat what this is, this is a 2008 Impreza. It's got uh, quite a bit of love to be given as I give you the walk around here. Morale armor mud flaps, huh? Can we get some love for that? Uh, yeah, it's a four speed auto. And to my surprise, somebody decided to put a EJ20 in there instead of the EJ25. God knows what happened to the EJ25 and why they decided they wanted like 30 less horsepower. I don't care, the thing uses practically no gas. So I'm not complaining. <laughs> Let me give you a little view from under the hood here. You gotta give it a little motivation, a preemptive pop, and then you can activate the hood struts, which the Evo doesn't even have, and this base model Impreza does have. Anyways, pretty basic. Just the average stuff going on here. I actually did completely rebuild this AC clutch kit with the magnet and everything there. Um, the car currently does have an oil leak from the dipstick. The radiator has been replaced, starter has been replaced, spark plug wires have been replaced, Denzo. Um, what else? It's got a new muffler, OEM of course, because uh, don't want to get pulled over too much in this one and uh yeah that's pretty much it it's got it's got uh oh i also put led headlights gave those a quick little restoration might need to rebuff those to make it better cosmetic damage wise obviously you're gonna see it needs a new bumper or a sick refresh on that one the fenders are kind of in need of some repair as you can see and uh, I mean, it's a pretty solid 10 footer car. My main hope for this car was I wanted something as a daily, which would serve me in traffic, which is why I got the auto. And I wanted something all wheel drive. I really, 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 really wanted something all wheel drive because my whole life I've been doing winters and front wheel drive. And then last year I went through the Evo. It was, I mean, I don't want to winter the Evo again because I don't want to damage it, but it was just, it was amazing having all wheel drive. There's no stress of getting stuck, no stress of slipping off the road, none of that. So it's, uh, look at that thing. Hopefully she survives a bit. It's a 2008 with 240,000 kilometers currently. Miles, I'm guessing that's probably around 160,000 miles. Correct me if I'm wrong. I'm curious what you guys think it's worth. Post in the comments what you think this car is worth, how much I paid for it. And uh, yeah, I'm really curious because I think I got a pretty good deal on it, but I wanna see what you guys have to say about that. Nevertheless, make sure you guys drop a like and a subscribe to follow along the journey for the Evo and the new member of the party. I appreciate all you guys for sticking around watching the whole video. And if the Google Forums is still available in the description, make sure to send me a picture of your car to be in a video. It's awesome. And yeah, hope you guys have a great rest of your day.